guys, today we're going to be showing you my favorite app to code with the phone, the iPhone. And what you do is just go into the app store and you search up, it's going to take a while to look, it's going slow today. You just search up coder with a K and it's right here, it has a gray logo. You download it, open it. So inside here, what you do is when you get in, make a folder, and the title is that site. Go in that folder and create your file just like you would on a computer. And since I like HTML, I'm going to make an HTML file. There we go. So then we open up and let's just hurry and make some code. So HTML. Title. World. This is we're just kind of recreating our Hello World tutorial real quick and on the phone. You can actually go check that out. Just go into our videos on the channel. And you can watch it if you want. And for our next videos, we're actually going to be making. Uh, Python videos. So if you like Python, we're gonna be coding with Python and showing you how things work like variables and other stuff like that. Because we like to do coding tricks. And that's who we are. Since we're getting this code in, we're just gonna, once we get it all in, I'm gonna show you another really cool feature with this that I haven't seen with any other app features that I really like. The nice thing about this, it has like no ads at all, if any. I haven't run into any yet since I've downloaded it, but I'm pretty sure we'll probably run into one or two. We have to make money somehow. But, so what you do is when you've got your code ri the rope, you just, with this little eye at the top and it basically opens up its own little browser and it has your file and it has your website all there so then another cool feature you can do with this is you can go into um, the, so there's an editor and say you want font size to be bigger you can you can change the font type as well, but you can also, I like the screen lock. So you use screen lock, you can make a password, just make it be just quick, one, two, three, four, and save, and apply, exit, and then we go back in, and it, has make, it makes you enter your password. Sadly, there is no I forgot password button, but it's still a pretty cool feature. At least I think. I'm actually going to turn that off. But there's also dark mode. Oh, like if you say, see, like my iPhone, it the main theme is dark, and so if you just have it be used to by setting, it automatically goes dark. But I like dark mode to be honest. So now we're done with that. But that's just a cool, it's just a cool app that you can use to make whatever you want. It works with Dropbox and any other web connections, really. I've used it with my Google Drive before. But you can use it with almost anything. So, thanks for watching, and please subscribe, like, comment, and we'll see you next time.